of it. So how are you? If you're new, how welcome and I miss Michelle. And this is a pick a card video. So if you see, let me bring this down. <coughs> we got three decks. We got this one, this one, and this one. One, two, and three. So if you want to know what's going to happen in the next two weeks for you, what do you need to be prepared for? You want to pick one of these. So let's go pick one, two, and three. Which one is the one you feel more drawn to? And then I'll do a reading on that. So let's go with this one. We're going to start with this one. This is deck one. Let's see what is going to come <coughs> for you in two weeks. Or what do we need to be aware of? Let's heads up for it. However you want to name this. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to give you three cards. Mm -mm -mm. So we got for you the Six of Swords, the Page of Wands, the Eight of Wands, and the Seven of Swords. Oh, shush, and the Five of Pentacles. So I do see Libra Energies, Aries, Leo, and then... Taurus energy with the five pentacles. Now, it does says right here that you need to be prepared to move forward because there is a big change happening. This change seems a little bit painful because, again, it was unexpected. But it says right here that you need to move forward confidently. You will be having to make the decision again to move forward confidently because bigger and better things are coming for you. There's also here... If you were hoping to get, let's say if it's a person to communicate with you, a response or so, I do see you're not going to get that. They want you to be ready for very difficult challenges as right now, they want you to be very careful with your money also to head up to a possible somebody maybe either or it's either or you or somebody who you know very well this could be a family member as well give them a good advice into keeping their house very close not having um i don't know valuables in their car because there's somebody may be trying to steal from them as well as they're saying right here to Check their bank statements or YouTube because maybe something that you bought online was through a third party, let's say. Um, they're taking away your card info. So that's a here, this here misfortune, unfortunately, and to where it's telling you that you need to make quick decisions. That even though that is quite hard, they want you to not hesitate whatsoever because bigger and better is coming but it depends on how quick you react on this situation there is unfortunately misfortune ahead but it's everything is workable and fixable is actually connected to properties and or money and to where either or this could be you losing your job but actually getting some something better down the road or this could also be um buying something online and you know getting your info stolen as well as leaving stuff in the car maybe somebody trying to break in as i said before this could be you or related to somebody super close to you as well as is saying that it's gonna actually let you if it's re romantically you have to move on from a specific person like let go of that person because it's just not gonna go anywhere so unfortunately what's coming for you is that okay so i'm sorry to be the one bringing such negative uh messages i'm going to give you a card so they're saying right here the first one says opportunity and it says there's no use looking for luck it arrives in unexpected times breathe slow down and contemplate the tea violet and ivy tangle around the eaves and grow all flowers must grow through dirt so Pretty much is for you to move forward confidently for other things. Maybe you were hesitant. It seems like you could be hesitant. Maybe you are procrastinating on what sense. Oh, present. Journey into the garden to escape the two eternities, the past and the future. So it's pretty much for you to stop procrastinating and moving forward. But I'm sorry that I'm the one giving you such bad news. But if you chose this deck, this is something that you need to give heads up because it seems like it's happening soon like i said before this could be directed to you or somebody you know are coming for the people who chose deck two 
okay let's see let's see what's happening and coming for those who chose deck number two My goodness these cards are so big let's see give you three cards So we got four of discs, seven of ones, four of cups, and the seven of cups. At the bottom, we got the prince of cups. Again, it came more cards. I follow the will of the universe. So we got here Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We got Sagittarius, Energy, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, and seven of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, and more water. So I do see right here that is transformation for you guys, actually getting out of a place that kept you restricted so i do see right here is not letting anybody or this specific person hurt you anymore i do see that is you getting out of your comfort zone and standing up for yourself the same time is you defending yourself and you actually gaining control so i do see right here somebody here is coming trying to put you down trying to hurt your feelings in a way to perform and the same way that this is your time to show this person that you are no longer the old you that you need to stand up for yourself as well also there's somebody maybe around work trying to take i don't know like like if they were the one uh taking like i don't know ownership of your idea at work saying oh i did it so they're saying right here do not let this person take credit over your hard work speak up because it's never going to change you need to start speaking up at work in the romantic sense in life in general so there's going to be a situation either or at work or in that romantic sense that is going to actually have you to stand up because you are a people's pleaser and you can't continue doing that as well as there's going to be somebody asking you for money don't give them money this is somebody you know that you constantly help in a way to perform but whenever you need help they don't help you back and or if you think that they're going to pay you back they're not going to pay you back either now with the four of cups right here i do see that it's time for you to stop taking treatment from this specific person in the romantic sense or friendship sense that is actually not good for you they're saying right here it's time for you to Stop taking cups and treatment that you don't like. Stop lowering your standards for such and such person. I do see right here that the universe is going to bring you a new person. But as of right now, I want to give you the truth is the person that you're interested in or could be in a current relationship in. And this is if you know that something is off, most likely you're going to find out they have been lying to you as well. So it's for you to make changes. Again, I do feel like changes is coming for a lot of people. But I do feel like it's not misfortune. It's for you to see people for who they really are for you to get out of your comfort zone for you to get out of a place that you think you can't get out of and to show yourself and everybody else how powerful you are start standing up for yourself and stop taking crap from people who don't really care for you but the seven of cups after you do that you're going to actually after all of this happens you're going to realize that you had had all the power all along and more opportunities are coming so once you realize that the person that you want or are with is lying and cheating or so it's saying right here that new opportunities and love are going to be showing up to you as well that your prince charming is coming but not now but for you is to set yourself free for now right now what's coming what you need to bring heads up is you're gonna find out things that is gonna set you free and you need to stand up for yourself stop taking crap from people who don't care for you babe it's, it's not okay it's not never gonna change it never gets better babe it never gets better now let me give you an advice here We got strength. This says, don't let weeds and thistles cultivate in your garden. Bloom and attract more than butterflies. Adapt. You will get yourself where you want to be and grow. All flowers must grow through dirt. Like I said before, changes, changes, and more. You chose this deck. Let's see what's coming. Let me just see what's coming for you. Okay. So it says right here that your wish answer is yes. Now, 
They want you to know that your lucky number is 786, by the way, and number 12. Now, they want you to know that you are very loved by multiple people. Even though that you could feel that you're not, you are very loved. Now, they want you to know to be responsible and guard against losses in the future, which translate if it's money, if it's properties, to actually cherish and value it and save it because in the future, there may be difficult times or difficult decisions. Now, they also want to give you good news. It's like whatever it is that you've been wishing and wanting, if it's an answer, if it's a callback, if it's an email or so, they're saying that you are going to get it and that you're going to be happier than ever. And it's something that you maybe never thought it was going to be possible. It says that you're going to be happier than you ever thought. And also it says right here to be aware because there's a woman trying to get in between you and your loved one. This could also be a, a mother-in-law, sister-in-law, uh, another person jealous of who, you know who you're dating so at this point keep an eye open of a woman who is trying to get in between you and your person so keep in mind that if you are talking to somebody if you are with somebody and somebody's like i don't know we're telling you oh he or she's doing this do, do your research because it may not be as true because what they want is the person you're with and because they're taken they're just trying to separate you both so make sure to always find all the information they're also giving you the heads up of like that you are a great dealer. I'm sorry, not dealer, but leader <laughs> and dealer maybe. But they're saying right here that you should actually take the leap of faith and start leading your future, leading your life, making those changes as well as telling you as well that maybe apply for that kind of job. They're saying that what are you holding back? It's like you are holding back. And also, oh my goodness, it says beware of a jealous woman. So I do feel like that woman here is there's a lady who's jealous of the connection so just make sure to look at all the possibilities before to jump in into conclusions and ending the relationship because it may not be true they may be just lying and making it up keep in mind baby that a lot of people are jealous out there sadly there are a lot of people who are like that who want what do what you have so but the same right here to maybe think about getting a job as a leader in order to lead yourself to success in a way to perform now the bonus card says serenity value quiet days with only the rustling leaves breaking the silence success bloom whatever you are planted weed don't tolerate less than you deserve forgiveness a crushed flower still gives off a sweet scent and then wallflower look for the crack in the concrete to find your way out so this is what i got for you my loves i hope you guys liked it it was very short but i tried to make it you know kind of short so it doesn't get too long um let me actually yeah i think that's it i hope you guys liked it don't forget to follow me on ig i tend to follow back i'm also on tiktok i'm also on spotify and twitch please check it out description box below as well as in the comment section on the pinned comment i am going to do twitch lives over there as well because here and in, in youtube could be sometimes a little bit um censored as you guys know if you guys did it i used to do a lot of like sexy tarot which i can't do as much as i wanted to because they don't let me so at this point i'm gonna do those and other uncensored things over there so readings obviously um spotify i tend to talk about multiple topics spirituality uh li li livelihood topics interviews and all of that so you want to check it out it's different content it's totally free by the way so with this said guys uh if you want to get a personal reading with me and get more clarification and whatever card and bundle you got make sure to book with me through my website you can actually go to the description box below as well as you can do it through instagram on the bio there's the links for all my website including my website for appointments so with that said guys i want to remind you that i do not offer any free readings outside the giveaways and i never 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 message anybody on any platform to offer my services so with that said thank you so much and have an amazing day <laughs>